telling you, do not do this TikTok trend. Another one? What is it? So the trend started in Ireland. There was a boy that went around carving keys in the back of people's pumpkins. Then he would light the candle. Wait, why would he do that? They believe that on October 31st, evil spirits would return to earth and try and get in your home. So people would take vegetables and carve faces in them. This would scare them away. But if they carved a key in it, it would do the opposite. It would give the spirits access to your home. Okay, I ain't scared of no ghosts. I'm gonna carve a key everywhere. My mom's, my sisters, my aunt, my dad. I don't even know where my dad is, but he getting the key too. <laughs> no, 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 you actually don't wanna do that. If one of the spirits gets into your home, they'll turn off your lights. Okay, so then I, would I just turn them back on? No, when you go to turn on your lights, you won't be home anymore. You'll be in a mansion. Bro, I beat Luigi's Mansion like five times as a light work. Well, this isn't just a mansion. It's actually a maze where the walls are made of mirrors. But you'll have to escape before the candle burns out. Okay, so what happens when the candle goes out? Well, it's not good. But there are two ways to get out. It works just like a normal maze. Start on one side, and exit on the other. Because the walls are made of mirrors, you usually can use the light method. If you point your phone's light in the direction you wanna explore, the light will reveal any mirrors directly in front of you. But the mirrors in this mansion are different. Instead of reflecting light, they absorb it, which means the light method won't work. However, the second way is easier. Just have a friend smash the pumpkin that has the key carved in it. Wait, what if you don't have friends? 